So I guess um, if, if you want a clearer message, what are some of the steps that you would take as a government? I mean, a lot of people criticize the, the rollout of boosters. It should have been done sooner. I know uh, one of my colleagues in French just asked, you know, if you're for or against the couvre-feu, uh, what I guess are some of the, the three main steps that you would be taking differently? Well, there's no, uh, there's no doubt in my mind that the, the situation we're in, a number of things which should have been uh, handled differently. Let's start with uh, the rapid testing, for example. Uh, we have been talking about this for over a year. Uh, and uh, we've been saying, you know, it doesn't matter if you don't use them, at least have a plan, make sure that you order them, make sure that they're readily available to the population in case we need them. Today, it's the only way that we can really uh, uh, make sure that people get tested, that the general population get tested, and we don't have those, uh, uh, those uh, rapid tests. So this is one element uh, that we need to get better understanding of. What is the plan? What is the plan of deployment? How are they going to be shipped, transmitted? Are we going to be using drugstores the way we use them the first time? I think a number of things need to be uh, clarified. Uh, same thing with the schooling. Uh, ventilation. Uh, we remember that we've been talking about this again for months now, and they haven't been uh, they, they haven't been deployed and in, uh, in the different schools. And we're asking the government to tell us what is the plan regarding that yet again. Uh, so those things can be clarified at the national assembly in order to really answer the questions from the population, uh, which is uh, which we have a hard time getting to uh, the answers.